So the game I'm playing today is called Sound Dodger Plus. This is a game that I had been meaning to make a video of for a while now, but I just never got around to doing it. It looks right up my alley, though. This is supposed to be a music-based bullet hell game. Of course, bullet hells being those games where you have to dodge an onslaught of bullets that are coming at you from all angles, to put it bluntly. And as you guys may or may not already know, I'm also a pretty big fan of rhythm games as well. Although, this game doesn't really have that much to do with rhythm, necessarily. This game may be music-based, but that's pretty much the only rhythm aspect of this game. The gameplay definitely isn't rhythm-based at all. I have played this a little bit off-screen, and it's definitely not rhythm-based gameplay, that's for sure. Basically, the way this game works is that you control a circle, you can move the circle around with your mouse, and all you have to do is dodge bullets, but the bullets... The bullets are not really timed with the music, I noticed. Well, their movement isn't anyway. And basically the objective of this game is to survive until the song ends. And once the song ends, you beat the level. Now, there are a variety of official levels in this game, of course. And this game actually has a lot of music from some pretty prominent indie game musicians. This game features music from artists such as Disaster Piece, who composed music for two indie games in particular, which were Fez and Bit Trip Runner 2, both of which are pretty popular. And this also contains music from Danny Baranowski, I think that's how you pronounce his last name, and he's responsible for composing some of the music in The Binding of Isaac. So you have some pretty well-known indie game musicians whose music can be found in this game. You also have the option to create your own levels, as you can see, there is a level editor right over here, and you also have user levels that you can play, so this game does have uh, custom levels. It doesn't have Steam Workshop support, but if you want to play custom levels, you can go here. There's also an auto-gen mode, which allows you to automatically generate levels using your own music, which is exactly what I did when I played this game off-screen. And last but not least, before I get to playing this game, this is meant to be an updated version of the original Sound Dodger, hence the name Sound Dodger Plus. I've never played the original Sound Dodger, but that's not important in the slightest, so how's about we get to actually playing this here? I'll probably play a few songs, maybe three or so, and then maybe after that I'll end the video? I don't know, depends on how long they are. Alright, so let's go take a look at this game's song selection then. Alright, so we have a lot of them. Okay, so right off the bat we already have Disaster Piece. Okay, so... I believe these, uh, these circles right here indicates the difficulty, and I think all the songs that are new are, uh, basically the ones that I haven't played before. So it seems like there's a lot of them here. As a matter of fact, how many of them are there? Oh my god. Okay, there's a lot of them. And it seems like most of them are locked. Okay, what is going on with the colors? Holy jeez, dude, there's like a ton of them. Okay then, and then I need hearts in order to, uh, unlock some of the, uh, some of the songs down over here. Alrighty then. So, it looks like I need a lot of points in order to unlock some of these songs. Okay, fine then. So which one should we go for first? You know what? Let's start off simple. Let's start with, uh, Daisy Wheel first by Disaster Piece. So here's basically the, uh, yeah, click and hold for slow motion. So yeah, here's basically the gameplay, guys. So as you can see right here, you're basically controlling this tiny little circle right here. And as with bullet hell games, um, if they hit the center of your circle, well, basically if they hit the hitbox, then, uh, like, on your circle, I mean, then, yeah, you, you, you take a hit. Now, when you do get hit, I found out that, uh, you don't actually die immediately. Oh, jeez, okay. Just dodge that. So, yeah, when you get hit in this game, you don't actually die immediately, but I think if you get hit again, you might. I don't know. There does appear to be a little cooldown. When you do get hit, your circle turns red, and I think if your, uh, circle goes back to being fully white, then, uh, you basically recovered all your health, I think. I'm, I'm not entirely sure, because when I was playing this off-screen, I only got hit once. That's the only way I even know that. I'm not entirely sure what happens if you get hit again, but I assume you die. So, this doesn't appear to be that difficult right now. Okay, actually, the bullets do appear to be timed to the music a little bit. But it's like, when I was playing this with my own music, it didn't seem like they were. It seemed like they were kind of firing uh, bullets at me in random patterns, but this is definitely synced with the music. But it's just the... Uh, I think the speed at which they're moving is not really timed with the music. Yeah, this is definitely... Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so I think if they if they graze the side of me, that doesn't count, right? That doesn't count as a hit? No, it doesn't seem like it does. So, yeah, you just need to wait until... You, you basically need to survive until the music ends. And as you can see, there's this circle over here that's uh, that's filling up. 
and I believe that indicates how far along you are in the song. Then once the circle gets completely filled, then the song will end. Holy jeez, dude. What's also a little disorienting is that all of these circles that are actually firing the bullets at me, they're all, like, rotating around me, and it's kind of, kind of making me a little bit dizzy here. Kind of uh, disorienting, but other than that, this level's not too complicated. Oh, jeez, okay. How are you all doing? Yeah, and you do get a score at the end of uh, at the end of the song. I also know that for a fact, and your score is a percentage. So if you're able to keep your circle white for 100% of the song, then I believe you get an achievement. Oh my god, okay. Not bad, not too bad. Maybe stay as far away from the, from the things that are actually throwing the bullets at me. But yeah, other than that, it doesn't seem to be uh, that complicated. Pretty simple gameplay. I don't, uh, I haven't had to use the slow motion effect right now. Because I can handle this. I can handle this pretty easily. The game does seem to be a little bit laggy, though. What is interesting is that you can toggle between uh, different frame rate options. Oh my god, okay. Yeah, so you can toggle between 30 FPS and 60. I have it set to 60, but even so, it still looks like it's... that the frame rate's going a little bit insane. There we go. So that one wasn't too difficult. I managed to get 100% on that, and I did get an achievement. A perfect start. It's funny because, once again, the achievement's not appearing in the game itself. Alright, so 100%. Very nice indeed. Alright, so I guess we'll just go back to tracks then. Um, oh yeah, and you also have Zen Mode. If I remember correctly, Zen Mode is basically where you can listen to the music without having to worry about bullets because it doesn't fire any bullets at you. Also, I actually forgot to mention this. There was a huge update that was released for Sound Dodger Plus just today, actually, which adds a bunch of new songs. Uh, a bunch of new DLC songs, I believe. But I think the update does uh, add all of the DLC songs into the game, so it's not like DLC that you have to purchase or anything. I'm probably not going to be able to play the DLC songs today, but yeah, I just wanted to mention that because I, I totally forgot about that. The game was updated today, and apparently there's a new bullet type in the game now as well. But I guess we'll go to this one next. Uh, dummy radio edit? Sure, why the heck not? Okay, right off the bat, you're already you're already throwing a ton of bullets at me. Wait, what did it say? I don't even... I wasn't even reading that. Score increases during... during slow motion? I'm not even sure... What the heck is this? Okay, this is weird. This is weird. Uh, please, let me go. Okay. Let's just... let's just take it slow. Let's just take it slow for now. Okay, never mind. I guess we're not taking it slow. Alright, yeah, this is definitely, uh... definitely rhythm-based. Okay, I guess the autogen levels maybe aren't... aren't all that rhythm-based. Oh jeez, okay, hang on a second, I have to time it with the rhythm, okay, never mind, I just got, I just got poked, for goodness sakes. Oh yeah, and there's also these, like, these, like, missile bullets as well, they just kinda, kinda follow you. I did notice that, if they make a complete turn, then they just stop, uh, they stop following you. Not really sure why they do that, oh my goodness gracious, that was a good dodge. Okay, hang on a second, this is only supposed to be a one, a one difficulty, like, one circle of, of difficulty level right here. Shouldn't already be getting hit by these things. This should be easy. Okay, what what exactly is this bullet pattern? Okay, I'm not comfortable with this. I ain't comfortable with this. Maybe I should start using slow motion here. But not right now. Not right now. Okay, maybe right now though. Let me let me just move over here, please. There we go. I don't know how much I can I can spam this though. Like I don't know if there's a limit as to how how often I can use the slow motion. I don't really know. Okay, and this thing is- Ah, what the heck is this? What is this? What is this? I don't even understand. Okay. Actually, these things aren't even going towards me. Yeah, I forgot. There's also, like- There's also, like, rolling balls in this game as well. And, yeah, that was just- That was just terrifying. Okay. Oh, what the heck is this? They're moving back and forth as well? Okay. I got some nice dubstep going on here at the very least. Oh, jeez. Okay. Stop doing that, please. Oh, no. Am I screwed? Please tell me I'm not screwed. Oh, uh, Just move. Thank you very much. Oh, jeez, okay. It's it's like scratching like a record when it, every time the talking bass lines come in. Oh my god, dude. What the heck is this, for goodness sakes? Okay, here come the rolling balls that I can very easily dodge. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. Okay, are you... Okay, no, they're still, they're still moving back and forth. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. I will survive. By the way, guys, if... Please be sure to support the actual people who created the uh, the music for this game, by the way. And just don't listen to my videos in order- if you want to listen to the music. Like, go and actually support the, the people who created the music for this game. 
And besides, I, I don't know if you'd even be able to hear the music anyway, guys, considering the fact that I'm talking over it. I mean, normally when I play music-based games like this, I don't like talking over the music, because I'd rather have you guys listen to it, you know, instead of hearing my annoying voice all the time, but... You know, considering that this game... This this game is more of a bullet hell than an actual, like, like rhythm game. How did I even get hit by that? But considering this game is more of a bullet hell than an actual rhythm game, I just thought maybe I could do this with commentary. Um, alright, so I got 92% on that. Wasn't, wasn't perfect, but it seems like I did unlock, uh, another, another level, though. Alright, yeah, that's the best I could get. You know what, this, this, this song right here sounds like some, some extreme dubstep. This is also a two difficulty level here, so I'd like to see what this is all about. Yeah, let's, 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 let's get down to this. Let's get down to some dubstep here. Alright, so let's see what the two difficulty levels are all about. The two circle difficulty. I also unlocked a three-circle difficulty song, I noticed. It seems like there's also chiptune in this game as well, so maybe I'll play one of the chiptune songs before ending this video. Maybe I'll play, like, two more, including this one, then that'll be it. Because other than that, that's really all I have to say about the game, guys. I mean, this is the entire gameplay right here. Okay, what is... what is... what are the, like, the... magenta-colored bullets? Or, that's not magenta, but... Okay, everything... oh, jeez, okay. They're all timed to the... to the baseline, oh, jeez. Stop. Uh, okay. That's not too bad, actually. Um... Right? Not too bad. Yeah, they just slow down and then they... Oh my god, what is happening right now? This is so... So... Like, make, making me so nervous. The way they're just moving back and forth, for goodness sakes. Seems like the only way I could actually predict this is if I listened to the music beforehand. I mean, like, like in the soundtrack. Like, the downloadable MP3 files that this game adds. Ah! Don't do that, please, stop! Holy crap, dude. Like, how are you supposed to even know that it's gonna happen? Well, I guess if, if, if the music becomes very repetitive, then yeah, you could probably tell it's about to happen. Holy jeez, dude. Just, okay. It's coming down a little bit right now, but I feel like it's something, something insane's about to happen. Yes, we're all slowing down, why? Why is this happening now? All right, bring the baseline back. Okay, well, there we go. You already brought the baseline back and you, you almost freaking murdered me with it. Okay, stop, stop. Oh, jeez, okay. Yeah, it's just going crazy now. Oh, stop, please. Okay, there, there. Not too bad. Not too shabby. At least I can predict the movement. I can predict the movement of these bullets. I almost accidentally ran into another one. Oh, 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 okay. Just scratch like a record. Good. I'm doing, doing fine right now. I, I, I guess. Uh, okay, never mind. Of course, as soon as I say that. Yeah, okay, you, you guys can just go away. The, the homing missiles. Okay, very good. Okay, why is everything just suddenly, like, freezing? Holy jeez, dude. I'm not enjoying this right now. Okay, yeah, I am just, I'm just sucking at this tremendously. I think because I'm not paying attention. But then again, I'm not paying full attention when I'm, when I'm commentating. Just, I want to squeeze on through right here. Squeeze on through to the other side. Everything's just slowing down again. Yeah, everything slows down until they they start launching bullets at me. Oh, okay, and then the the little uh, circles disappear. I guess after they stop throwing bullets at me. Well, that sucked. Eighty-one percent. I mean, I still got an I still uh, unlocked a new level, but yeah, that was that was crap show right there. But then again, this is my first time playing the game, so I mean, don't be too mad at me. Alright, well, here's that three difficulty level that I unlocked. This sounds like, like, frigging NES dubstep or something. Yeah, let's, let's try this one then. Let's see how difficult this is. Wow, right off the bat, are you serious? Okay, fine then. Fine then, game. I'll play along. I'll play along. There we go. It's a nice chip tune right here. And already I'm getting hit by crap. Great. Yeah, I also, I also don't like the fact that the music just suddenly speeds up when you get hit as well. Really do not like that at all. Uh, okay. I see red ball. Oh my god, dude! Like I'm not even I'm not even paying attention at this point. Stop. I need I need to try and concentrate on this. Okay. Rolling balls. Got all the red rolling balls. Okay, good. I can I can easily dodge this. Watch watch me jinx that and get hit. Oh, okay. Oh no no no! I'm gonna slow down, please. I'm gonna slow down. I think it did tell me that if you use slowdown way too much, it does clutter up the entire screen, so I guess it doesn't, like... I guess it still throws bullets at you even when you're in slow motion. Wow. Okay. What even is the... Oh my goodness gracious. I don't want to keep spamming it, though. That's that's the problem. Like, I don't I don't want to keep over... I don't want to overuse uh, slow motion. Okay, go, go away. 
Go away, missiles, please. Stop following me. Alright, just, just know where the balls are going, and also know where the missiles are going at the same time. I'm just gonna pass on through, please. Just let me by you, you. Just let me pass on through. Are you just gonna let me pass on through? Okay, thank you very much. Thank you for OGs. Oh, thank you for OGs. Oh, okay, I think I'm gonna go back this way. Alright, very good. I don't know, but that also slows down the music. Okay. It's all- it's doing weird things now. Okay, that's too many homing missiles for me to handle. No, thank you. Oh wait, can I just stay in the center? Oh my god, and it's backing up again as well? No. Don't like that. Okay, hang on. Can I just stay in this area? I can. Okay. Yeah, it's- it's calming down. For now. For the time being. Alright. Just stay calm. Keep calm and carry on. Just move a little bit. Don't stay- oh my god, do it. Also, that- that- how did that even, like, like, scare me? Like, that legitimately startled me as well. I don't even- holy crap, dude. I'm just- I'm becoming a nervous wreck of playing this game. And I've only been playing it for, like, 15 minutes. This is ridiculous. Okay. These things are just, like, are, like, curving or something. Okay, this is getting a little bit disorienting now. Okay, is it just gonna stay calm for the remainder of the song? It looks like it's going to, actually. Don't pull anything crazy on me, okay? Yeah, they- the bullets are curving. You done? Okay, you are done. Good. Okay. Gee is. Well, I mean, at least I got a- I got a bit of a better score, 83%. I mean, to be fair, that was a three difficulty song as well. So, I mean, it was obviously meant to be very difficult. Still unlocked a new song, though. Uh, what exactly did I unlock here? Walk in the park? Yeah. Okay. And I also unlocked this song right here, which sounds like like some good, good drum and bass right here. You know what? I'll play one more song before I end this video. How about we try Distant Stars here? Let's listen to some, to some drum and bass. And not only that, but this is a, a three difficulty song, so that's fantastic. But this is gonna be very easy. This is gonna be very simple. Just a simple little challenge. Okay. Well, it might not be simple if it if it's starting to rotate. Okay, here we go. Just gotta dodge all the blue bullets. Gotta dodge all the blue triangles. There's also apparently a 3D mode in this game now, but uh, the only way you can unlock it is by completing all of the single player levels, I think. Okay, can I just stay in the center? Yeah, I just dodge all of them. Okay, is the music slowing down actually? All right. Yeah, everything everything is slowing down. Okay, it's it's starting to speed up now. Oh jeez. Okay, here's the build-up. Here's the build-up right before the drop. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, this is getting a little bit too fast for me. Uh, stay in the center. Yeah, okay. Oh jeez, wow. Now they're really, they're really spinning around. Oh my god, okay, this is gonna be an absolute nightmare to pay attention to. But pay attention to it as best as you can. I know it's, it's really difficult to do that when you're commentating, but still. Maybe I can just stay in the center and maybe just move around a little bit. Okay, yeah, this is actually not that- not that tricky. That's not that challenging. I can literally just stay in the center. Okay, maybe that's what I have to do for the majority of this song, I'm, I'm not even sure. It seems like that- that's what I can do. How did I even... I- see, I think the problem is that I'm not moving my mouse fast enough. Oh jeez, and I'm also not paying attention as well. And I'm being too stupid to use the slow motion. Even though I don't really want to. Because I th I think what it said actually was that... My score increases when I just play the game normally, not when I'm using slow motion. Okay, there we go. I think we're about halfway through. Okay, what is this? What is this? Okay, I can still stay in the center? Maybe I just need to stay in the center. Or do I? Okay, you guys aren't even targeting me anymore. What is even going on? Are you trying to make me sti- Are you trying to make me sick or something, game? Holy jeez. Okay. Okay, well I can't stay in the center now, because look at what's happening. Oh jeez, okay, find the path. Find the freaking path. Through the madness, through the fire and the flames, we carry on. Okay, there we go. Very good indeed. If that if that song was actually playable in this game, what would the bullet patterns even look like? Probably be absolute insanity, probably be impossible. Because everything would be would be timed to the guitar riffs. Oh jeez. Okay. This is not bad. Like this this part right here, this section. It isn't bad, because all I have to do is just stay in the center, and just move around a little bit. Kind of follow the way they're, uh, they're rotating around me. Yeah, see? That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Alright. Just move around a little bit. 
Because I think I think we're pretty much at the end of the song, or we're almost at the end. Because I think now it's only gonna just start firing the the blue bullets at me. I think I think the song's pretty much done. The song the song is done throwing all of its all of its crap at me. Is it? Yes, it is. Good. All right. Just had to calm down with that. Even though it still made me nervous as all heck. Got 96%. That's pretty good. What did I what did I get? Chloroplast skin. Okay, another three-star difficulty song. What even is this music? What the heck is this game soundtrack anyway? Alright, well anyway. I think I am gonna stop for now, guys. So that is it for Sound Dodger, guys. If there's one thing I learned about myself by playing this game, it's that I apparently become a nervous wreck whenever I play music-based bullet hells. I have no idea why. Like, I don't know why th this game was making me so nervous when I was actually playing it. I mean, after playing this, it doesn't appear as though you can actually die in this game. Because you can get hit multiple times. Maybe, maybe when your circle turns red, that's like a cooldown timer. Like, you become invincible for a short while, and the red represents you becoming invincible from all bullets. But once that runs out, then you can get hit by bullets again. But maybe you can't die in any of these levels. Maybe it just keeps going on until the level ends, and then at the end your score is tallied up, and based on how many times you've gotten hit, your score will be either a high percentage or a really low percentage. So I don't really have to worry about failing any of these levels, because it doesn't really seem like you can quote-unquote fail them, but the amount of percentage points that you receive depends on your actual score, and I guess in order to unlock the other songs, you need to get good scores on every single song in the game, at least 80% on them, it seems, in order to unlock the next, uh, the next level. Or maybe it accumulates. Maybe it totals all of them up across all the songs you play it. I don't know, but either way, that was still really cool, though. That was definitely, uh, a fun little game, and I am definitely going to try and unlock all the other songs. Maybe use my own music in, uh, the game as well, just to see what kind of levels I can generate. You know what? Maybe maybe I'll actually try that. Maybe I could put Through the Fire and Flames by Dragon Force and see what kind of bullet patterns it gives me. I can only imagine it'll be absolute hell. And I guess I could also uh, look at some of the user levels that people have made for this game. So yeah, that was definitely really fun though, but holy crap, I... This is, this is why I don't commentate music-based games, guys, because I just... I cannot concentrate at all. Like, these are the kinds of games that require a ton of concentration in order for you to do good. Like, this... It really isn't good for commentating at all, because I just cannot concentrate. Either way, though, if you want to purchase this game, the link is in the description. And also, be sure to uh, support the musicians who actually, uh, you know, provided the music for this game by purchasing its soundtrack as well. I think there is a deluxe edition of Sound Dodger Plus that you can purchase, too. And I think the deluxe version contains the game's official soundtrack. So definitely pick it up on Steam and support the developers and the musicians who, who created this really awesome game. Anyway... Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video I make. Later!